Hey guys, it's just a little coffee and today inside of this Monster Legends Guide is we don't going to be telling you guys how to get free mythics out of the new bounty hunt. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so in order to participate in this bounty hunt, you are going to have to pick a team first thing before going in. And your team is going to want to be a three monsters and it is going to want to be able to do as much damage as possible. So just pick your two highest damaging monsters and then probably a monster with damage boost or something like that. You just want to be able to do as much damage as possible to the bounty so that is basically what you're going to want to pick and then once you go ahead and pick your team you will be put on a grid and this grid you will be put on it with a bunch of other players and you will basically be competing against these players in order to do more damage to the bounty but first of course one of you has to find the bounty and you will be working together in order to find the bounty so to find the bounty you want to click on these shapes on the grid and then they'll flip over and you'll either get a reward or you'll get nothing or you will find the bounty most of the time you'll just get a reward a little bag of like food or gold or something like that or like salaries and then it'll show you an arrow pointing to where the bounty is and then you just keep following the arrows until you find the bounty and you can of course see the other people on the grid's arrows as well so you just want to follow all of the arrows until you find the bounty and then once you find the bounty you will go ahead and fight it with your team that you went ahead and built before you entered the bounty hunt and you just want to do as much damage as possible to this bounty in order to reach the thresholds in its health because if you are the one to reach the thresholds you will go and get more rewards than the people you are fighting against and those people will also be fighting the bounty at the same time so you just want to try to do as much damage as possible and more damage than the other people on the grid and then once the bounty is defeated you will get a bunch of rewards depending on how good you did and how much damage you did and most of those will be bounty coins you will get more coins if you do more damage and then you will go ahead and want to bring those coins into the bounty shop in order to go ahead and exchange them for salaries for monsters. And you can get a lot of different monsters and a lot of them are really good. So definitely keep an eye out for that. And yeah, you can go ahead and fight the bounty again. After you beat him, you'll be put on a new grid with new people and a new bounty. And then you just repeat the whole process in order to get more coins to get more monsters. And yeah, that is pretty much the bounty hunt. So this is the best event in the game for getting mythic. So definitely make sure to do it. It is very, very important that you guys participate inside of the bounty hunts. And yeah, that is pretty much all you need to know about the bounty hunt. So yeah, pretty much just go on the grid, go ahead and fight the bounty. Well, first you have to find the bounty. And then once you find it, you want to fight it, do the most damage as possible, and then rinse and repeat. So let me know down in the comments what monsters you guys are going to be trying to get out of the bounty shop. And if you guys are going to be participating in the bounty hunt. And I'll see you in the next one. Over to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.